Marty, and we're playing the troll community. I'm telling you right now, for my fucking health, for my physical well being, I need you all to fucking back off and leave me alone. Because my eczema is started up so bad on the back of my leg that I can't even fucking walk. It fucking hurts to walk. Y'all don't understand the amount of fucking pain I'm in. Even just trying to do some things like stand or bend over. This shit fucking hurts. Every day I'm in fucking pain. Even though I don't show it, every day I am in fucking pain and I'm sick of being in fucking pain. I know I need to go to the fucking doctor. I know I do, but I fucking can't because Marty wants to sit there and fucking attack my shit. You think this shit's funny and it's not. I'm not even kidding. My leg hurts so fucking bad right now. <laughs> Marty, William, and Roy, I am begging you guys to fucking back off of me. Back the fuck off. You and all your friends need to leave me alone. Leave my shit alone. So I can go to the hospital and get the fucking help that I fucking need. But you don't want to do that, do you? That's too good for you, ain't it? You'd rather sit here and watch and laugh as I arrive in fucking pain every fucking day and night. You'd rather sit there and laugh as my skin slowly fucking peels away as I arrive in fucking pain. Not knowing what to do. I know what you guys are probably thinking. Why can't you just go to the hospital? Because I know the minute that I fucking leave, Marty's going to attack my fucking computer. And I'm not about to have that shit happen. I'm not about to let my shit be attacked over some fucking fat ass. You all think this shit's funny, but it's not. My physical health is being affected by this shit. I want to go to the hospital so bad, but I fucking can't. Because I'm not going to put my job at risk of Marty doing what he's fucking doing. I refuse to let my shit be put at risk.
every day I wake up in vain. Every night I go to bed in vain. And it hurts so bad to fucking walk. And you know what's fucked up, Marty? You're the one that caused all this. All the stress you fucking put me under. All the stress you fucking put me under, Nick, is what caused this shit. And it's not just my head, dude. It's my fucking leg as well. My leg is just as bad as my head is, if not worse, on the back of my fucking knee. Sad thing is, I can't go to the fucking hospital for another two weeks until my friend gets back. Because I'm not going to leave my shit unintended. I'm not going to leave my shit unlooked after. Because I would rather suffer in pain than give up my shit. No, I don't need a fucking ambulance. What I need is for people to fuck off and leave my shit alone. At least long enough for me to go to the fucking hospital and get and start getting well again. That's what I need. I need people to fuck off and leave me the hell alone. That's what I need. I need people to fuck off so I can start physically and mentally getting better. That's what I fucking need. Let me tell you right now. Y'all think you know pain. You don't know shit. You don't know what it's like to live in my fucking body day in and day out. I'm fighting so fucking hard to hold back the tears of pain. Every step you take, you just feel like your leg's gonna fucking explode. That's what my leg fucking feels like. Because that's how bad the flare-ups have been lately because of fucking Marty and what he's put me through. Imagine somebody taking a sharp knife that's been lit on fire and torched and it's super hot and they're just fucking digging at your skin as they fucking twist that knife into you on the inside. That's how bad it fucking hurts. That's how bad it fucking hurts to walk. And 
And Marty, that's why I am fucking begging you. And William and Edward Boy to please back the fuck off of me so I can get well. Leave me alone so I can get well. It's bad enough that I gotta deal with the fucking dermatitis on my head. Now I gotta deal with the fucking eczema all over my body. And to the point that it's so bad on the back of my fucking leg that it hurts to fucking walk. I wish y'all trolls could feel my fucking pain right now. I really do. I wish y'all could feel the fucking pain that I'm in. I wish y'all could fucking feel the pain that I'm in every day. I really do. Why do you think I haven't been fucking doing anything? Why do you think whenever I do these cover shows, I haven't been standing up? Why I've been sitting down so much? That's why. Because at least when I'm sitting down, I can keep my leg from being in fucking pain. And y'all think that it's funny what I'm going through. All I got to say is for those of you that fucking hate me and are glad that I'm in pain. All I have to say is this. I hope that karma comes back around and smacks you in the face so hard that you won't know what the fuck to do with yourself. I really do. I hope karma comes back around and bites you on the ass so fucking hard that you'll be screaming in just as much pain as I am. Y'all think this shit's funny and it's not. It's very fucking painful.
Y'all really think this shit's funny, but it's not. So, Marty, I'm telling you and William and Edward, boy, all three of you guys and all your little friends, I'm telling all three of you right now, back the fuck off of me. Let me do what I need to do to get well. Let me fucking heal myself. Marty, I'm telling you right now, you need to back the fuck off. You and William and N-Word Boy, all three need to fucking back the hell off. Now. Because if I catch you in my shit again, there will be legal repercussions. I've already spoken with some of my friends and the people that they work with. And there will be legal repercussions from their end if you continue to do this. So my advice to you, Marty, back off and leave me alone unless you want to get arrested. You might think this is a game, boy, but it's not. I'm trying to heal and get well. While you sit here and try to hold me back from doing well and getting well. <laughs>